Okay, so this is the new workshop. Uh, so we'll do a little workshop tour here for you guys at Modeling with the Mats. Firstly, and most importantly, the stash. Uh, not quite as big as Tin Man's or Mat number two, but uh, definitely decent size. Um, that's actually going to be gone. That will not be around. Uh, and then we have the paint booth. Uh, this is where I'll be doing airbrushing, spray painting, and that vents out to that window, which is screwed shut. Uh, this is my shelving unit for my 3D printing um, stuff. Got all my alcohol up there, my resin, which I'm going to be getting two more bottles, my gloves, and all that other stuff. This is my Ligu Mars 2 uh, Pro 3D printer. Um, and this is its whole station. So, printer, slap mat for cleaning, and then a curing station, a UV curing station. Um, honestly, guys, this is probably one of the best 3D printers I've ever used. Um, easy to set up. I've had maybe two failed prints, and I've printed a lot. Um, speaking of printing, this is my miniature painting station. This is where all my minis get painted. This is actually gonna. This was actually my new, um, one of my new 3D prints. A big chunky boy dragon. That is one wing. It's gonna look massive. Um, these are all my prints. Yes, mat number one. That is your power station. Um, but basically, these are minis ready to be printed. I have my power there, my wet palette, my brushes. Um, then I've got all my paints, uh, these are the, uh, contrast paints from Army Painter, um, amazing paints if you haven't used them, uh, these are my metallics, my washes, inks, and then all my Tamiya colors, of course they have to be labeled because I'm colorblind, uh, some of my Vallejo paints as well behind there and some of my diorama stuff, and then... Last but not least, this is my model building station. Got my build area here, all my tools that I use all the time. Uh, alligator clip, sticks, brushes, sanding sticks. Um, this stuff was actually all on my workbench before. Uh, this is now up on shelves, so it's up out of the way. Uh, all my tapes, my glues, my washes, thinners, spray paints, and then all the other stuff that I need to build models. Dremel, battery charger. This is my shelf or drawer unit that has all my smaller tools like my sprue cutters, camouflage plastic putty. If you haven't used this stuff to make camo, I highly recommend it. Um, extra Tamiya bottles, my decal or decal stuff for all you Americans, my pastels, and then I've got my sculpting stuff and writing instruments, templates. Basically everything you need to build it all. It's a much better build and organized area with the shelving. Um, actually, I'm going to leave that wall blank or maybe put some pictures up on it. Um, I got a lot of storage underneath that I still haven't filled up, but it's pretty much done. Got a power strip here that's actually attached to the base as well as that one over there, which is also attached to the base. Two high-end shop lights that give me more than enough light. So now that this is done, this will be it. Um, so coming up next will be my Game Changers video that I wanted to do. Basically to show you guys, especially the new modelers and new into the hobby, what really is game-changing for me. Thanks.